Hi, this is Alan Park, the member of Team Dapo. In this project, our team developed a smart contract named Governor C. This is a fully decentralized civil resistant quadratic voting system based on Chainlink VRF. Recently, DAO, which stands for Decentralized Autonomous Organization, emerged as the innovative organization system for the healthy community governance. This is the new governance system for the coming Web3 ecosystem. DAO-based services are trying new innovative methods to improve weakness current centralized governance systems have. The key for building successful DAO is making fair governance system so lots of community members can make their voices and lead the group on the better direction. To build better DAO environment, many DAO participants try to develop governance voting system in a fairer way. Quadratic voting method, which make the cost of purchasing tickets increases exponentially, has emerged to compensate for the weakness of existing methods. However, this alternative is also exposed to the risk of civil attack. By creating multiple accounts, several voters with the bad intentions can show inappropriate voting power. So, our team would like to suggest improved voting system Governor C, which is a fully decentralized, civil-resistant quadratic voting system based on Chainlink VRF. To make civil-resistant quadratic voting system, we suggest a new voting system method, probability quadratic voting. We develop three things. First, the PQV method to improve quadratic voting. Second, a voting contract system called Governor C. Last, we built a service by using Governor C contract. PQV is the civil resistant quadratic voting method this team developed. This method makes it always a loose to do civil attack by applying probability element on quadratic voting. Splitting voting power makes the expected value of voting power always lower than executing one voting power. This team also did a simulation based on Pareto distribution. High similarity with quadratic voting and civil resistance have proved, and also found the most optimal hyperparameter based on simulation. Governor C. Charlie is a smart contract for voting system based on PQV we suggested. We used Chainlink VRF to implement the probability factor of PQV. To make this open source solution more scalable, this country follows the compound governance module standard, which is one of the most widely used standard in DAO ecosystem. Current DAOs using compound module based on Governor B can easily apply our new solution Governor C, which is developed under the same standard. Finally, we showed our demo, which applied Governor C contract on governance. By providing scalable and decentralized open source solution, we want to activate the entire DAO ecosystem based on fair decision making system. Want to make more people to engage in healthy governance and community. Before I finish my presentation, I want to show next steps for this project. First, we are going to upgrade Governor C contract on the next level. Our open source project improved compound governance module Governor B based on PQV and Chainlink VRF. This team is going to study other methods, which could be Governor D, to improve governance system. Second, this project wants to expand the usage of PQV to other areas. We want to use PQV in several other fields like quadratic funding, quadratic ranking, and quadratic attention payments. This is the end of Team Dapil's presentation. Thank you for listening and wish all the DAO ecosystem to be improved in the healthy direction. Let me show the demo video of our service. This is the governance webpage based on Governor C contract. First, you can connect your wallet directly with the governance site without KYC, which is the centralized proof of identity process. Now, I'm going to vote on the proposal with active status. When you click it, you can see the details of the proposals. The number of votes here shows expected value, not the real number of votes. Now, I'm going to cast a vote for the fourth side. This finalized proposal is the proposal past valid voting period, but probability factor of PQV is not applied yet. If you execute the PQV with transaction, it will show the status of succeeded or defeated. After everything executed, the expected value of votes turns to the real result. You can see the number has changed. When finally all the process executed, the status turns to executed.